Amen. This is a tag contest. 20 minutes duration, two falls, two submissions, or one kill to decide the winner. In the blue corner, from the north, known as the elite from Barnsley, Steve Best. And his partner, ladies and gentlemen, from Manchester, Johnny Singh. And in the red corner, from Brixton, the tough guy, Steve Logan. And his partner, ladies and gentlemen, he did not touch I'm sure, the European middleweight champion, the incomparable Mick McManus. Well, I don't know about you at home, but here at ringside, we can't hear, each, can't hear ourselves think at all. But in case you didn't get that announcement from MC Charlie Fisher, it's 20 minutes tag contest, two falls, two submissions to his side. Logan and McManus versus the elite, composed of, comprised rather of Johnny Saint and Steve Best. Commence wrestling. 20 minutes, two falls. McManus and Johnny Saint. I think you'll be able to identify them in all cases, but uh, the black, very much darker trunks of the elite, Saint and Best. So McManus tags, in goes Logan versus Saint. So our second main bout of the afternoon, still one or two to come. Really a tremendous bill here today at the Assembly Hall Walthamstow and a packed house for it. Saint with a tattoo mark, shoulders and forearms. Logan with one, just one on his right forearm. In both cases, the hair color should help identify if you can't tell by the trunks. That's if anybody doesn't know Logan and McManus by sight. So it's Logan versus Best. Steve Best from York. Trying to prevent the straight arm left, Logan, and making McManus, best. Now it's the left hand, McManus, left hand. It's the one to watch, not the right, as the referee's watching. Tony Mancelli warning him not to take hold of best trunks again, but he didn't notice the left hand was at the throat. So it's Saint in. Head lock and strangle McManus on Saint. Yes, I thought McManus would come back with one of those pretty soon. This is really solid form of defense, that attacking move. Short range jab. He and Logan both very powerful at that. The follow down just a wee bit late, but it's allowed. 
not effective. Quick tag, McManus out quicker than he's ever gone out. McManus in again, and now deciding to get out finally onto his tag rope where he should have been in the first place. Logan versus Johnny Saint. Best versus Logan. Johnny Saint there at the far side of the ring. Doesn't know it yet, I don't think, but he's got one of the ring studs in his right shoe, wrestling boot. And if that ever comes through to the sole of his foot, he's going to know all about it. Very difficult to warn him from here. Until anyway, there's a fall or a submission. Give us a break to warn the referee. Nobody spotted it yet at all. Not a public warning, no, no public warning there. Asked for, but not given. And in comes Saint again now against Logan. Difficult to tell whose side they're on. A crowd here. The elite. Exactly is their name. Really superb wrestling skill, both of them. But they've met this afternoon a couple of the tough forearm boys. In the shape of McManus and Logan. And it's going to be difficult to be able to use some of their skillful moves. And they walk into that sort of thing all the time. Logan feigning a little bit there. The Saints gone out. In comes Best. And the tag. So Best continues with McManus. Saint was tempted to put that tag rope around McManus' neck then. He didn't actually do so. Now, whether that was a punch or not, that certainly wasn't. And both men tagged, so it's Saint versus Logan. Switching to a chancery, but that's how neatly Saint gets out of that. Chancery as well. Oh, a 
it's a real turn. And the tag, yes, I think he tags. No, Mancini won't allow it. He, Mc, McManus tagging through the ropes instead of over the top of them. So it wasn't legal. to go still no score two falls to decide it and McManus versus Johnny Saints of the Elites yes they've really started this uh, special oh, but his man wasn't up then and he gets a public warning for that the referee issues his first public warning to Mick McManus and Steve Logan Should be an easy one for McManus here. Very simple folding body press. Shoulders right down. So the first one to McManus now, over Saint. Nine minutes, ladies and gentlemen. That was the first ball to Mick McManus and Steve Logan. In just 11 minutes, McManus Logan team now leading one to nil over the elites. Manus. No, it's the no, it's the other other side. It's Johnny Saint that's got the trouble with his right foot. And Tony Mansulli now going over to have a look. Left foot, sorry. It's the pen. One of these uh, pins from the ringside. Uh, there, the apron of the ring. So now we can go ahead with Saint and McManus, of course, as is the law. And McManus, a great chance of finishing this off 2 0 now. One public warning against McManus already. This time Saint switched it. The big drop. And the flying tackle. If he can get McManus over. Now the cross press finish. He's got it. Now, in 13 minutes, ladies and gentlemen, that was an equalizing fall to Johnny Sane and Steve Best. So, if you heard that announcement from MC Charlie Fisher in the hubbub here at the Assembly Hall Waltham Show, that's the equalizing fall announced in 12 minutes, 27 seconds of this bout. So, just about uh, seven minutes plus to go as we go ahead any second. Seconds away, continue the wrestling. Saint versus McManus still, and that looked very like a clench fest to Tony Mansulli as well. Over the top for a shoulder press, not quite. Gets a count of one. 
faint in the body scissors. Possible for Boston crowd. Well, you've probably heard that timekeeper's announcement. Five minutes to go. And a quick tag as McManus gets Logan in to save him fast. But he's in no better state. And in comes Best now to complete the treatment on Logan. And back comes Johnny Saint. The elite now really delivering a few drop kicks on this trip. A little too low, so that's better. Oh! Terrific forearm by Logan, right in the stomach. And Saint screaming at his partner to get up. Six, and of course it's going to be easy for Logan now, following down with that reverse top of knee hold. It must be easy with his weight. And yes, Saints and Best, so disappointing for them. They're doing so well. But that now knee came dead right. Steve Logan and Mick McManus. 